Michael, come help me. I think the baby is coming. Oh my God, don't worry Linda, I'll drive us to the hospital right now. Doctor, is my wife going to be okay? She'll be fine. All she needs to do is push, 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 push. Congratulations, it's a boy. What would you like to name him? Oh, it's a boy. What are we going to do, Linda? We only thought of girl names. I don't know, Michael. I was just about to ask you that. What do you think we should name him since we only thought of girl names? Well, I can't really think of any boy names right now, and I also don't want him to be named Michael Jr., so I guess let's just name him after my brother even though he already named his son after him too. Hey there my baby Joseph, what do you want to do today? Mommy, I want some chocolate peanuts, give me some now. Oh my god, Joseph just said his first words. I can't wait to tell Michael about this when he gets home. Man, running on the playground is making me tired. I think I'll just sit on this bench until the bell rings. Hey, you're sitting on my milkshake. Get off of it right now, you stupid idiot. What are you talking about, man? I didn't see or feel any milkshake when I sat down on this bench. Hey, what the fuck? I was gonna drink that. I'm telling the teacher about this. Hey, that was actually fun. I don't know what he was talking about, but I think I'm gonna fart in every single milkshake I see now. <laughs> Alright, time for another day of school. I hope Bob and Joe Mama don't annoy the shit out of me again like they always do. Hey Mark, hey Mark, hey Mark, 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 Mark. Oh my freaking god, not again. What do you want from me now Joe Mama? Can you please stop saying my name over and over again every time you want to tell me something? Sorry Mark, but anyways I wanted to tell you wait why did my voice turn deeper all of a sudden? Oh wait, I think I just hit puberty now, too bad you don't have a deep voice like me Mark. Ha 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 ha. Oh man Joe Mama, playing truth or dare with you is so much fun, but anyways, it's your turn now, so truth, or dare. Oh you know me Bob, I'm going with dare again, I've literally been choosing dare for all my turns so far. Well, alright then, so anyways Joe Mama, since you have your bag of Halloween candy from yesterday, I dare you to eat every single piece of candy in your bag until all the candy is gone. Look at that Bob, I managed to eat every single piece of candy in my bag without stopping, I'm the truth or dare champion. Wow Joe Mama, I can't believe you finished the whole bag, you may be the truth or dare champion, but just look at you, you're so fat now. <laughs> Alright, time to order myself a bunch of milkshakes so I can fart in them all. <laughs> oh. Hello Joe Mama, I didn't know you were working here now. Oh, hey there Bob, nice to see you again, and I'm assuming you're here to order yourself a bunch of milkshakes just so you can fart in them all again. Yes, that's exactly what I'm here for Joe Mama, anyways I would like an order of 12 milkshakes, can you do that for me? Sure thing Bob, here's your 12 milkshakes. Anyways, I hope you enjoy farting in them. Joe Mama, what the hell have you been doing? I told you to tell the customers that it's $1.50 per milkshake, not give the milkshakes away for free. As for you, Bob, I have told you over and over again that you're still banned from my store for farting in all the customers' milkshakes. Get out now before I call the cops. <laughs> and as for you Joe Mama, you're fired. You're not allowed to give away free milkshakes. Were you even paying attention to a single word I was saying during the interview? 
thanks for arresting this guy officer, this guy scammed me like three times yesterday. No problem, he's been on our wanted list throughout the past two weeks because he's been doing nothing but going around Calgary scamming people. Um, hey there Paul, but do you think you can come bail your pal Joe Mama out of jail? What, no, and sorry pal, but you took all my money so no of course I'm not bailing you out, you scammed me three times yesterday you idiot. Well anyways Bob, I'm done telling my life story now, since you told me your life story on Sunday, I decided to tell you mine, I hope you enjoyed hearing it.